New Zealand's impressive win over Australia and Ben Smith's performance in particular wouldn't have escaped the notice of Sitaveni Sivavatu. Between 2005 and 11, the former All Black Wing was one of the game's most exciting players with 29 tries in 45 test appearances. But for the past two years, he's been playing his rugby in France for Clermont Auvergne. You know, it's, uh, it's not eye opener coming to France. They're very, very lovely people. They can play as well. <laughs> so I just came and jumped on board. And I didn't know it was a, you know, it was a very good club. And the difference between the southern and the French is like uh, the French can smell your blood. Once you, once they smell your fear, that's it. You know, they get up. Once they get up, there's no backing down. Born and raised in Fiji, rugby was always going to play a major part in his life. I started playing rugby at school, and you know. Every Fijian, young boys, you know, we, we love rugby. Uh, you start early, young, just kick around balls around the backyard and playing touch every afternoon. is a, It's an everyday thing. You know, if you're in the village, you play touch every afternoon. Aged 15, Sivavatu moved to New Zealand, where he quickly rose through the ranks. It wasn't long before he caught the attention of the All Black selectors, and in 2005, he made a dramatic debut, scoring four tries. His opponents? Fiji. You know, I'm pretty lucky to play against my country. It's just business. You know, once you put on the jersey, uh, you play it as, as a team. Uh, it was one of the best moments, to be quite honest, in my rugby career. You know, rugby is a, is a sort of like a sports and a friendship as well. And when you play rugby on the field, everything's on. But when you go off and walk off the field, you know, you get along, you, you sort of have that bond. In 2007, New Zealand travelled to France as World Cup favourites, but they returned home chastened after a quarter-final defeat to the hosts. A lot of people, you know, uh, were pretty disappointed, but, you know, that's the life of the sports. You win some and you lose some, but, you know, you, you just have to keep going, I guess. And, you know, we learn a lot from that. You know, as you turn up and see the people, you know, appreciate you coming back, it's, you know, it's awesome. Injuries then began to take their toll, and his last All Blacks appearance was two years ago against Australia. But there are no regrets. I love this place. And uh, I love the people. <coughs> and, uh, you know, we, you, you have to think about reality and uh, the age you're playing. And, you, know, you can only play for so long. After, you got to move on and somebody else step in. So that's just the life of it. And I've enjoyed my time, uh, you know, every moment of it, enjoyed it. And uh, right now, I'm, you know, I'm over it. I, I'm with a French team now and, you know, I'm, I'm enjoying life.